and you still thank me every single day for the small things. As big as he was, the biggest thing you know he had, and as prideful of was his heart. He was caring, he was sharing, he was damn strong as a bull, but he also never forgot where he came from, and he was humble and true. Full of the Tennessee twerks he never lost. Yes, ma'am, no, sir. And uh, again, one of the reasons why my wife loved him because she used to, used to call him Miss Ali. So, he was a keeper. Um, again, like I said, we, we've all got special memories of Dallas. Hold on to them dearly. You don't know, obviously, where life can turn. We had big plans. We spoke about them daily. He used to come to me asking me for, for advice daily on business to, to end, just to be a better person. If he had critiques given by judges, he worked in them. He was told that he needed to work on his app. He trained them every single day after he told that. He was a man of making improvements and he used to thank me, like I said, of, of letting me give him the advice. But little did he know. He was also teaching me at the same time. So remember, Dallas for everything that he gave you. And each and every year we're going to celebrate his life, his 26 years of life on the stage, picking up your babies, shaking hands into the last man's good, and again we're celebrating his life because he was a damn good guy. So guys, I want you to ask one more time for us. Please stand up. And we'll clap Dallas off the stage three. You know, growing up, watching the sport and uh, kind of following along, even, even when I wasn't bodybuilding, even when I didn't even know if I was going to bodybuild. I guess the, the main thing for me is, like, I just want to put on a good show for the audience. Like, if everybody, you know... If, hey, you know, just put on your show for the fans. That's what it's really all about, right? This is my dream come true. This is everything uh, for the last few years. This is everything I've worked for right here.